Seb and Jamie actually raced each other together in the Nations Cup uh, yesterday and uh, Jamie got the win. She won, she did indeed. That field are full of confidence uh, for this run. She was so excited to be facing up against Sebastian Vettel. Big hero of hers growing up. And uh, Seb has looked really quick on the snow and ice this weekend. But as you say, Jamie had the measure of Sebastian Vettel yesterday. And we have the green light and we're off. Chadwick on the outside in the red car. Vettel on the inside in the black car. Uh, back into the Polaris Razors once again. Uh, and Chadwick loving it out there on the, on the snow and ice this weekend. Yeah, we have to keep our eyes open because the driving style of this car and how to go fast is different to the other cars. Uh, we'll have to learn as, as the day goes by what is fast and what's not. Um, I think at this moment it's pretty equal so far. They both need a good result now and they know what happened yesterday. They know it was a close race and uh, it's all up for grabs. Seb knows how much you can abuse this car, how much you can ride the banks, use it almost to, to turn and pitch the car if you get those banks in the right moment. Chadwick over the jump, nice and measured from her over the line. Chadwick will, of course, have the uh, faster time, having had that outside faster line for the first half of the lap. But the gap of 4.3 puts advantage slightly towards Sebastian Vettel at the moment. Maybe Jamie was getting too confident after that win yesterday. It looks like Seb has, uh, has stepped it up a notch and, uh, and, and is driving really well. Chadwick now on that tighter inside line. Rounding towards the end of the lap and it's a frustrating end for the drivers here on that inside line because you have to cut back right under the tunnel, then a really hard left, flicking back right onto the start-finish stretch. Whereas if you have the, uh, the outside track over the jump, and Vettel will have this one easily already over the jump as Chadwick takes the final corner. Vettel takes the win. Chadwick comes home uh, about uh, one and a half seconds behind Sebastian Vettel. It's a one win apiece for them over the course of this weekend. But today, champion of champions, it's 1-0 to Sebastian Vettel. The gap, one and a half seconds. So Chadwick needs to win and win by more than 1.5 seconds if she is going to knock out Sebastian Vettel. It's a good start from Vettel. Nice start from Chadwick as well. Nice, clean, tiny down into uh, turn one. Chadwick, though, knows she has it all to do to defeat Sebastian Vettel and to do it by a decent margin if she wants to go through to the next round. You've really got to be brave in this car, really wrestle it around, make sure they've got down on the gear. As you see, Seb there is on the handbrake, getting the rotation to get on power. This fast and flowing section near the water there is super cool, and then you can bring so much speed into this corner. You see Seb just tapping the handbrake. He's not really locking the wheels, but he's just opening the central dip there by pulling the handbrake a little bit, opening the release valve, and that just allows the car to rotate that slight bit more up the gears here. And uh, this is the fastest part of the straight, and this is a tricky braking. You can see the grooves here really digging out from people having locked their wheels and digging their eyes out. So it's like you're on train tracks when you're braking there. Chadwick 5.7 back, so Vettel definitely with that advantage. Looking fantastic right now. Here's the four-time Formula One world champion. Loves the race of champions. Contested it for many years with Michael Schumacher. Team Germany having won the Nations Cup a record eight times. Sebastian Vettel winning one of those by himself without a teammate. Partnered up with Mick Schumacher for the Nations Cup. Continuing that beautiful relationship with the Schumacher family. Rounds the final corner, crosses the line. Vettel takes the win. It's 2-0 over Jamie Chadwick.